the Princess of Wales and Duchess of Edinburgh are a force to be reckoned with, claims former BBC royal correspondent Jenny Bond. The pair have been described as stars of the family as the two of them stand as frontline royals. The royal ladies both married into the royal family, Sophie married Prince Edward in 1999 and Kate married Prince William in 2011. Ms Bond exclusively told OK, it is so much more evident now that Catherine and Sophie are key members of the list of working royals. At Buckingham Palace Garden Party, we saw them taking their place as senior members of the family. I think people have really taken Sophie to their hearts in the past few years, especially after she showed her obvious grief at losing Prince Philip and Queen. Her evident closeness with them was so much more than a bond, it looked like a deep affection for her in-laws. She added, and she was a huge support to the late Queen after Philip's death, popping round and watching movies with her, riding with her. Both she and Catherine have a common touch. Perhaps because they lived normal lives before marrying. Meghan Markle is now the most popular member of the royal family, new report finds they connect with the people they meet and look as if they really want to chat. They are the new female stars of the show, elegant, engaging and empathetic. A royal aide spoke to the Daily Mail about Sophie's close bond with a late queen. They said, the queen, talks to Sophie in the way she used to talk to Princess Margaret. Sophie has filled a terrible gap in the queen's life that was left when her sister and the queen mother died in 2002. Kate and William snubbed from Big Perk in new role as royal tradition done away with a source previously told Us Weekly that Kate was a rock for the late Queen throughout the coronavirus pandemic. They added that the late monarch saw the then Cambridges as the future of the monarchy and trusted Kate and William's judgment implicitly. Sophie and Kate both stepped out for royal engagements on Tuesday, Sophie in London and Kate in Bath. Sophie stepped out for a garden party at Buckingham Palace in honor of the Not Forgotten Association. Not Forgotten Association is a tri-service charity which provides entertainment, leisure and recreation for ex-service men and women with disabilities or illness and serving personnel who are wounded, injured or sick. Kate visited Bath to spend time with Dame Kelly Holmes Trust to honor Mental Health Awareness Week. Melting